Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, man. We're excited today because we get to start working on the front of this because our stuff come in. Summit Racing, boys. So we got these in. We already opened them. We had to. We had to make sure everything was all good. Yeah, I had to make sure, make sure it's right. Oh. Well, the red thing fell off. But it's real nice. We got the, the disc brake spindles. Look at that, boys. That looks good. Yeah, we got these. Now we're ready to put these on Nova, but also we got what? What else did we get here? Oh, right here it is. Finally, after five, we took your advice. Hardware for the... This drop shackle. The drop. It's not a drop shackle, but the shackles for the leaf. Look at, look at the thickness of these. Yeah. Yeah, these are from what? Because they sent us something. It says Detroit Speed Engineering. So we got that, and we also just went ahead and bought some of those. Yep. So we don't you have never, to use those. You ones. always need them. Yeah, because, so guys, so I'm gonna get down here. We're gonna spray a little more blaster on there real quick, and then start looking at exactly everything we need. But so far we got this, because I know we're gonna need needle nose, pick a fork, that, this, that. This, that, this, that. Yeah, we're that, gonna be this. using our GoPro Pro in this video yeah, a little we're bit. Get, hopefully, get it working right because I got a new card. <laughs> but uh, let's get to work. So you're, what are you doing, Hunts? Well, we got the sticker they sent us, so we're gonna put it right on the box. Guys, if y'all have stickers, we're gonna try it. to fill this up. So if you want to send us one, hey, just message us. Message us. We'll give you a, a PO box and. You can put your stickers on here. That'd be cool, wouldn't it? Oh yeah, so let's get to work. Let's do it. All right guys, I got, I'm got. i gonna try not to get dirty. Does anyone think I can do this without getting dirty? No, you'll break those gloves in two seconds. So I got my seat, good my old blaster. Old, good old tire. It's a good old Craftsman screwdriver I don't care to bend with. Some, my needle nose. So we got our tools ready, so let's start taking this thing apart. Yeah, I'm ready. All right. We gotta get some of this junk cleaned off here so we can see what's going on. So you can see where the carter pins been. Yeah. I wish I had my glasses, Hunter. Is that it right here? Yep. What was that? It's probably full of gunk. It is. I mean bad, ain't it? So we gotta get this straightened out. Might use a screwdriver to pry them out. Don't wanna hurt those. I might need a... You need a pick. A big, do we have those strong pick? No. I think we all, all we have is those little ones. What thing's in there, ain't it? Oh yeah. Hmm. Let me get you a pick. I'll get you one. If it breaks, it breaks. It is what it is, right? Yep. Okay. Well, we got some vice grips out because the little pick I brought, it was not working. No, it didn't. Whoops. I'm gonna tighten them things on up. Vice grips are good for about everything. Yeah, they are. Get a hold of something. Put this through there. There you go. Like I knew what I was doing. I'm glad we bought some new ones so we don't have to reuse <laughs> that. I know. I mean, they're they're pretty decent. I mean, you can save them, but. We'll save them, because we got tons of them. They're good but, to always have. You know, that tool haul. We got a ton of those. I know. Okay, so. That socket is right behind you. Should I try this first? And see if they put it tight? Yeah. Oh, nope. They did it right. Well, then you can just take it off of that. Yeah. I didn't know if uh, like it would have been so. But we did spray this before we left that day. And well, some people over tighten those. Yeah, I know. And you're not supposed to. No. It's supposed to go down to where it sort of like, then do a what? Half turn, Half turn back. back. Yeah. We watched a lot of videos on that when we did it with the Mustang. Yeah. We'll keep this stuff. 
I mean, you can always have, you always need those. Like if you're out on a will it run video and you yep. need one, you can throw it on there. All right, there we go. We'll get the, the persuaders and do a little. A little bit of work. A little bit of You got the two pound one right behind you. This one plays music though. <laughs> Oh, watch them drunk. Those brakes just shoot off there. I want to kind of save these in case we know somebody might need them. Yeah. Okay, there we can get that out. That will help take the washer off. Just so I can get it out there enough to... Well, I think the bearings are bad in this anyways. Probably. Dude, I swear it looks like it doesn't. Beautiful. Might need Those that. Those look like they would need more grease anyways, oh, like repacked. Oh, I think they're shot. Really? Yeah. Are they? No, they no, work. No, they're pretty good. They just would need repacked, I think. So yeah, they, they're working. So we might just save those. And we'll save everything with this because we'll keep these spindles. Come on, baby. I could loosen the brake. That's probably what you're going to have to do. We have those tools that we got in that tool haul for brakes. Yeah, we need to do that because it's probably tied against it. Yeah. Persuade it a little. Oh, yeah, here we go. Come on, baby. Yeah. Good catch. Yep. <laughs> Ow. That thing's Let's heavy. That. Yeah. How bad a shape are those in? Well, pretty. Yeah. Look at the sides over here. On the Dude, they're pack. bad. Yeah. They're shot. See the heat marks on it? Well, look how much it's ate into it. Yeah. Yeah, it's probably good we're changing this anyways. Yeah, I guarantee you it's good. So, I guess I probably need to... We have that brake tool we got. Yeah, we need to start taking this Thing assembly apart. apart. Because I think there's two bolts I got to take off back here. Because I got to keep this piece that bolts on to the, you know, the thingy dewey. The, so, let's get our tool. Yeah. <laughs> Taking this off now. Yep. These things have seen better days. <laughs> you can tell where we painted them. <laughs> Don't judge. Now we gotta get that king nut off there. And yeah, what size is that? There's all kinds of sockets right there. What what size do you think it is? You're good at that. I don't know, half inch. Slam. You know what we don't have? Three eighths ratchet, so I'll go. Three eighths ratchet. But get get the I'll get one. All right, guys, we're going to take this, look, this off right here, this king nut, so I can get this. For the steering off. Oh, Are y'all tighten? Of course. You know me. Ugh. Holy cow. Uh. Did it turn or? Uh, nope. I'll but... get a breaker bar. All right, guys, I want you to look at this. Bring that light in here and show them. This thing has been rounded off. And then it broke. It's brittle. It's just, I don't know how I'm going to get it off here. Does anyone know? I don't, I don't know. I mean, there's got to be a way. You know? Yeah. Okay. Let us know down below because for the next side, yeah, if we so don't get to it. Let us know down below. Yeah. So we know how to do we're it. We're battling here, man. It's it's kind of frustrating when I mean, but I know this is an old car. This car is two years older than I am. But someone put it on way too tight and somebody, rounded it, it off. Somebody rounded off. Uh, it's just been through it. So I'm gonna have to just work on this, guys. I'm, I'm not gonna bore you. I'm gonna battle with it and try to get it off here. Okay. So let's do it.
<laughs> my goodness. Oh my God, that thing is destroyed. I'm gonna, Hold it up. I want you to look at this. Somebody, right somebody rounded that thing off. Badly. Badly, I'm gonna have to get a new one of that. <coughs> get <Whoa. to> you. <laughs> Got choked up, boys. All right. Oh, it smells <laughs> like. No, don't taste that. I want to taste it. No, you have PB Blaster on it. Oh. Oh, uh, but guys, can you just go to your local hardware store oh, and yeah. buy that? Oh, yeah. Okay. should have that. Or AutoZone. We'll, we'll get that from AutoZone. Oh, yeah. So, what we have to do here is break out the pickle fork. Yep. Uh, I've never used one of these. Have you not? No. I haven't either. I think I did. No? No? No. Oh, my goodness. I think First you go up everything. here, right? Still good oh, on yep. it? Just got wedged. Yep. Good. Perfect. All right. One down. Ten more. I'm just kidding. I mean, <laughs> now we got to take this part off. Yeah. Because we got to use it with the other one. So, um, what does that consist of? Hunter, look in here. Look at these nuts right here. I gotta have. I can use I can use a crescent wrench, but do you know what size that is? Uh, no, but I got I some socket right there. Cause I mean, I got almost every socket size. And what does it look like to you? This one? Uh, try it. Too big. Too big. Next one down. Too big. Nope. That's it. Now I can use the crisp. Try to put a it. socket on a socket. You usually got to take that off. Um. You, you could use a crescent wrench to hold the back side. Yeah, is it the square? Is it square on the back side? I don't know. This so wasn't the Mustang. It had a square piece yeah, on it. Yeah, but I don't think this one is. This oh, okay. This is Chevy. I mean, it is Chevy, so. You know, it's done right. Done different. <laughs> well, great. We broke the, the piece we were using. Oh, what a night. Guys, this is what happens when you're having too much fun. You know the saying is, you break everything. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm like a dentist. I hey, don't even talk about that. <laughs> <laughs> well, guys, you know what I probably need to use? Our impact. Our impact, yeah. I just need to wipe my gloves off. Just get the big, you want me to go get it? I'll get it. We'll get the big daddy out. Go over and get it, Hunter. All right, guys, when things go wrong, you just break out the big daddy, right? Yep. I mean, surely to goodness. <laughs> it worked. Surely to goodness that will work. Well, that see, we just need to get out the right things at first. Yeah. Isn't there another oh, bolt? That is so hot. Well, drop it. Yeah, I like the way it feels, though. It's like burning fire. All right, there's another one right here. Let me get my head back here so I can see. There we go. Don't leave your head in there, it'll be super loud. <laughs> that would be funny. That's a real old one. I think it's a J.H. Williams. Yeah. Yeah. Man, that's a nice little crescent. It's from that one haul we had. Did you see a thumb spring back coming? Yeah. All right, we got to keep this. Look at the, how, the look at the design that Chevy come up with. Oh yeah. All right. Set Guys, to the side. We're gonna sit right here because we probably will need it. Well, yeah. Again, we might need those two. All right, pull the drum. Pull the, I guess that's the drum. No, I mean, I gotta. Now, we have to take these kingpins. Oh, yeah, you put, gotta. I, I gotta put a jack under this so I don't get knocked out by. Spring. Spring. Because that would not be fun. Guys, you know, can I be honest with you right now? Uh, I, this is the first time I've ever done this. Yeah. I mean, because the break, the conversion for the Mustang was a whole lot was easier. Way, it was very simple. Yeah. Now this. 
It's not difficult, but we just have never done it. I've just never done it because I know there's steps to it. I have no clue. So we're just going with the flow. Yeah, we're we're going with it. We're just going to let things shoot across the room if it does. I don't know about that. We're already that. making a pile of things I break. Because yeah. Hunter thinks I just break everything. I mean, you, you I didn't break did. this. Just give you a couple minutes. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, guys, I'm going to get down here and look and look around for a minute. Then I'll get back with you. Can't video with that last shot. <laughs> well, here. I mean, it's it's dark back here. I, I cannot see. Can you just turn the steering wheel? Well, I mean, you don't have to. We don't hit the steering. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. Shut up. <laughs> okay, guys, sorry about blinding us, but I couldn't see back here. It's so dark. That's funny, though. You was like, turn the steering wheel. <laughs> but uh, I got to take these pins out. Let me see if I can see. Yeah, yeah. Come, come on this side. Can you come over here, like? Right here. Kind of sprawled out. Well, I mean, I'm taking it easy. It's supposed to be my relaxing time. I got to pull these pins. Look how corroded these are. I wonder how hard they're going to be to get off here. Uh, not too bad. Um, so, I got to pull these pins, get these two off. Not knock the top off first. I don't know. I don't know. Never done this I've before. Never done it. <laughs> and then knock the bottom one off. Yep. Oh, let's get to it. <laughs> Got out some ratchets. I mean wrenches that we could hit on. <laughs> yeah, they don't need no names. Yeah, the it's no like, names are the best to hit on because yeah. they don't matter if you end up breaking them. Because you uh, you can give a few dollars for these at, at the pawn shop. Anywhere, like you can go to a flea market, and probably get a whole box for like twenty five cents. Really? No, but I mean, cool though. You know what it looks like? I'm gonna have to do. Take that sway bar. That, it doesn't look like it. I don't know. We'll see. I could, well, no, we'll see. I'll keep going and see. All right, Hunter. The question is, I'm going the wrong way. I mean, that. Uh, oh, man, it's We probably need to undo the brake line, too. Yeah, I'll cut it. Cut it? Yeah, we don't need it because it has new brake lines. Yeah, but why would you cut it? I don't know, because I like cutting things. No, we can always reuse that. All right, we'll undo it. But most people let it swing down. With it on it? <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> okay, I'm just joking. So we're gonna get that uh, nut off there and then move on to the next step? Yep. I thought I had it right there, but it's out of tough spot. Man, these, this thing, this thing needed this done. Yeah. So bad. Who wants drum brakes in the front? No one. How can you do burnouts? We just need to unhook all the brakes in the back, though. But yeah, I'm thinking about just not even hooking them up. We're just going to have front brakes on. I saw this one person, they made a switch you can turn. See, that's what I want to do. And I it cuts switch. off the back brakes. Where we can, all right, there we go, guys. Thunder! So should I take the brake lines off now? Substat is the spider bite in my back? Uh, I think you're laying on a wire brush. <laughs> oh, I was like, man, something is like eating me up. So all we right. need to take the brake lines loose. Dude, this Pittsburgh bar, I recommend if you don't, if you want to use things to beat with, it's not bad. No, it works good. Yeah, it held on there and then I have to give these a good rating. Oh, they, so, they Mr. No good. Name, whoever built these, hey, thumbs up. They work. Wrench up. <laughs> All right, let's go get the brake lights off. All right, this deer lasts. They're pretty good. Yeah, the brake line tools are. I wonder if there's any brake fluid in it. Yeah, I guarantee there is. So, I'll probably need to move a couple of things. Yeah. 
Like all the that socketry. Can you believe I got that up without breaking it? No. We got we got a bunch of these pins. We'll replace new ones if we can find the ones for it. Yeah, Turn I mean, that line a little we, bit. We got we got them because yeah. See the brake brake fluid coming out. Yeah. You know I should have took that turkey baster and drained that brake fluid. <laughs> but you know what? That's what the floor is for. Well, you can put no brake fluid in it. Yeah, I mean, I don't. I wasn't going to use the brake fluid out of this thing. Uh, and we can add some blinker fluid in there. Yeah, you know they make some good. Uh, Duralast makes good blinker fluid. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> My daughter would fall for that one. Yeah, she would. I love that girl. So when we get this thing unhooked, what what do you think the next step is? Uh, Are we gonna un un have to unhook that spray bar? I, I think I'm gonna have to. So anyone, before I get to it, well, well I'm gonna be done by the time you, I see your comments. <laughs> so we're gonna get to it. Get this thing loose. Yeah. You know we have an electric ratchet. I don't even wanna hear it. <laughs> you don't tell me no sooner. <laughs> you love doing that to me, don't you? Well, you should know. Oh. Man, it's my arm. I know, but I forget. I get carried away too. <sighs> we decided to take the sway bar off. Yeah, take it loose so we can drop it down. Well, not take it off, but take that bolt out. Yeah. Oh. Eey. Are you okay? Uh, yeah, I've been in therapy today for this arm. And it's hurting. It's hurting. But yeah. guys. It's worth it. You gotta, you gotta do this to get these cars right. So let's get this thing. Yeah. Done. There it is. Whoa. Finally. <laughs> Man, that was a job right there, boys. We got that. It just took a little persuasion. Well, well, I mean, I knew that thing moved. Well, we just had to get the pickle fork out and start hitting. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, there we go, boys. We got that out. So let's get the other spindles ready to throw it on in. Yes, sir. We got our spindle here. We're gonna leave this on just for now until protect we assemble this to protect the threads. So, and then we got we got to figure this out. We got one part of the conversion. That is a dust. Is that called a dust plate? Yeah, and it goes just like that. Now show them how we know which side this goes on. It has an L for left. Let's try it up there. Right somewhere. Right up there. Right there. L left. Drivers, I wasn't even showing it. <laughs> Look, hold on one more time. L for left. Which left is the what? Driver side. Driver side, I believe. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. I know. <laughs> So, so show them show them the pieces you the nuts and stuff the bolts and stuff you have we got this one it hooks up to this top one i'll show you in a second and when this one came with the conversion it's longer than the bolts that came with it so it can feed through for the extra yeah. length we need so because you have to use the the steering bar part of it yeah off the old one so hunter's getting this it could be frustrating we're not putting that one bolt. Uh, right here, buddy. Oh, right out of sight. So he just gets that one started for just to hold it in purposes. Place. Purposes. <laughs> hold go. on, let me see. Uh, you know how how you're able to do this? Because of that right there. <laughs> yeah, baby. YouTube certified price customs. If you, guys, if you hadn't liked, subscribe. This thing, I might have to give you a hand. I got it. I was trying to... Do it all at once. Yeah. Sometimes you just got to get that bolt through first. Well, you're making it look like a cakewalk now. Just a second ago, it looked like as a... Well, we had to familiar... Get used to how this is. I get too frustrated. Hunter's like, Dad, let me, let me try this one. I said, okay. And look at him. He's he's flying. <laughs> Hit it with a hammer. Uh, I don't want to mess those threads up. Sometimes you just got to hold it up in the air. 
Yep. Never heard anybody has it. Nope. And then look at him, what he's doing. He's feeding that on. Beautiful. Now we Beautiful. Just the... Now you just gotta get the nuts on there without it all falling fall, fall back apart. Dude, that is an easy conversion. It's pretty cool. Yeah. Wow. And then we'll just need to tighten everything down. So are we gonna go ahead and put the disc brake or put this part on first, then put the disc? Uh, a lot of people, I don't know. I've seen them mix. I see a lot of people assemble it, on it all together, but and then, then put it on. Yeah. I mean, do you want to do that or do you want to? It might be easier to put it on than put it on. Who knows? Well, let's just get to it. All right. We got our big half inch ratchet out with the size of this. 15 sixteenths. So he's going to tighten, tighten that. This down. Come here and look at these pins. So once we get it tightened up, we got to pinch these pins. Those wings. Those wings or whatever. I call them pins, but I meant <laughs> wings. Against this uh, bolt so it can't ever back out. Yes. Hey, that's, that's cool pretty design. pretty wise. Yeah. What if you didn't? It could back out, and that would be the end of your braking. Who needs brakes anyway? <laughs> well, you kind of do on the front for burnouts. That is true. <laughs> Make sure that you kind of line the flat part up with the wing. We, That'd we be it good. Has to That'd be more. good. It has to go more, but. Okay. You know, I just gotta, you remember what size this was? I, I just put it that underneath and then use the, the big impact and just. I don't see I, that ending well. You want me to do it? Probably so, because I don't want to smash my hand. Side a little. <laughs> hey, you know what? You don't want something to come off, you impact it. Give it all the ugga duggas. All of them. Ooh. I don't know if I can get that on that one. That's great. You know what we're gonna have to do with this one? What? Uh, do it from the back side. Hopefully I'm strong enough. Are we gonna put the the uh, the disc on there? Uh, what do you think? We do? It might be easier to get it put on than put put it on because we need to check them bearings anyway. Yeah. Um, that way. But I mean, we could. You could just do it, but you can if you want. But we're gonna throw the spindle on first. Yeah, just so we can um, make sure everything goes. Make smoother. sure everything works out. So let's do it. All right. Like what Hunter was saying is, you got to get these wings and bend them up here. So this thing will never, ever, ever. It's a pretty cool design. Ever work its way off here. This wing, this one's harder. But that's cool design, so we're gonna get that. And then. Hey, uh, do we have? I should take a little. Oh man, your cool little hammer is at the yeah, house. Yeah, it's garage. at the house. But I'm gonna have to get something and just and tap, tap them on up, it. and uh, so it won't ever come loose. And man, that is a pretty cool design. And that's it for this thing. This thing it? looks so cool. Yeah, so I'm gonna get that real quick. So I, here, this is how you usually do it. This is how you do it where I'm from. Isn't that cool? If it works, it works. I might have to pry that up a little more, but yeah, we, we, you you understand. So we'll get this and then get it in the car. Get it on the car. All right, guys. Well, let's we'll see how hard it's gonna be to get this thing on here. That was so hard. Well, that that was pretty easy. So do we need to tighten the bottom one first? Um, I don't and know. And then pick up to the... We should probably tighten the top one, you think? Then jack it up the bottom up? I don't know. 
Uh, this is our first time ever doing this. Hey guys, this is, I mean, it's pretty cool though, man. Look, we're going to have disc brakes. It's going to be sick. I'm so excited. We're going to have discs all the way around. Yeah. Can you believe it's that? It's going to be legit. This Nova's come a long way. Thanks from after a five clunker to, From a junker to a clunker to a hot rod. Oh, yeah. I mean, it's every stage. And big thanks to After Five. After Five, thank you, my friend. Check it out. We're doing it. We've never done this. You told us we can do it. We believe it. Yeah. Dude, we trust After Five because he told us about them shackles back there or he's whatever our, you call I them. I mean, he's our homie. Hey, he is. He's our boy. We really appreciate him. But look, the dust plate, just enough to clear. This is perfect. Look at that. It's like it was made for this car. It's like it was made for an oven. It was. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get this going. In the surface rust. <laughs> <laughs> well, once you hit the brakes a time or two. Oh, yeah. Because one time that. we were in Florida and my sister's car, we let it sit for a couple of days. And then the brakes were solid rusted. And then we just hit the brakes a couple of times and it was perfect. Yep, look like brand new ones. So the bearings are already, look. And they're greased up. They're packed and everything. Yep. So what we need you to need do. You need to take that thing off. <laughs> is I got to take that off. But also, I need to get some grease. And so put it on there. put all on that. So let's go get the grease to do well, it. Yeah, we'll get the grease, do it, and we'll get our new king nut, king nut and a new pin. And we got the pins in. This, I just temporarily stuck it on there. Because yeah, we got to get a new king nut for yeah, it. Yeah, I got to get a new king nut. But I don't want that thing flopping around on me while I'm trying to put this on. So uh, let's go get it. We're getting this thing put on here. And we got our new king nut that I just dropped in the floor. Yep. We got grease. If you look, we got grease all in here. Yep. We're gonna put this front bearing in. Front bearing. You, you wanna use this one or this one? The one that has grease on it, might as well. Might as well, since it's lubed up. And the king nut, I think you're sitting on. I was wondering what that was. <laughs> Yeah. No, I wasn't well, it was right below you. Close. <laughs> it's right under your foot. New king nut. Oh my goodness, guys, this is exciting. You see what's going on here? Coming a hot rod. <laughs> All right. Is that the pin? Yeah, right there. Yeah. But there we go. What you do? Let me get this. Where's that at? Where is it? Get it right there. Have to turn back. There we go. Touch your pin in. Hold we'll on. put our pin in, and there we go. Oh, I ain't got nothing to <laughs> Alright. Get that dust cap on. Bam! There we go. Now I guess we just put the caliper on. Let's just sit it on there for right now. And see what it looks like. See what it looks like. Man, that's exciting, dude. Yeah, that's legit. That's so exciting. Hunter. We're getting this put on here. Yeah, I just don't. It's a little. <clears throat> oh, there it goes. It's a little finicky. Finicky. We got our brake lines, they're gonna work out just perfect. It's like it was made for this car, like I'll almost, say again. Almost like it was perfectly engineered. Engineered. For this exact car. Yeah, if I could get these to lock. 
You're not used to doing brake jobs. You know, I used to do them all the time. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That'd be easier to start with the bottom one. Alright. You know what? Uh, you know what it is? I just can't see. Have you heard that a lot today? Yeah, you've said it probably 15 times in the past five minutes. Alright. And where'd that go? Uh, don't know. But we're gonna have to find the ball. <laughs> you looked everywhere, and it was on the control arm the whole time. Yeah, this is the uh, and the red's perfect because it's the Freedom Nova. Oh yeah, we're just tightening them up and shazam! We're gonna have brakes, boys. Yeah, let's step back and look at this thing. Man, that looks good. Does that look better than that drums? Look at that old drums. Yeah. See ya. See ya, my guys. This has been exciting. Our first time getting disc brakes put on the Chevy. And I said I'll see if I could do it without getting dirty. You took your gloves off. I've done good until you took your gloves took off. Took my gloves off. <laughs> but guys, we got a mess. Had to compress that that caliper and it had some brake fluid in it so yeah at least that's hey hey we used our tool we got to our caliper yep. compressor Harbor freight how to become a mechanic yep check that video out he'll put it up here somewhere maybe somewhere somewhere it, 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 that's a good video man. i like if it you want then tell us your comments what you would do different what you'd add to it check it out guys that was the first time we done it it's tomorrow done. we it's, we're gonna see if we can find that king oh, the nut. king nut, yeah. If we can find it, we'll put it on. Yeah, we'll put it on. But guys, we it's done. done. We just got the other side to go, but we're not bringing us through that, man. No, yeah. we just wanted to show us one side. Yeah, one side, but guys, this breaks on three, three parts now. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's leave that one drum and see what happens. I don't know what no, would happen. <laughs> what guys, would happen? Let us know down below. Yeah, that's pretty cool, guys. Check it out. The yeah. Freedom Nova, man, it's coming together. It's becoming a real hot rod. Now it's getting some bald eagles. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I hey, said uh, too much. <laughs> yeah. But uh, we're going to put that probably in a couple of videos. We, I don't know if we'll film that, but we might put the new master cylinder on. We might put a, a booster. I don't know. We'll just have to see. I just want to see. We got the master cylinder for the disc brakes. For disc brakes, brakes so. all the way around. So that's perfect. So we got that. But we're wondering, should we put... A, it would always be better with the booster. Yeah, just so you have power brakes. But do we want to take vacuum out of that motor? I don't know. Comment down below what Comment you think. Comment down below, should we leave it manual or should we go with the booster? But what I'm worried brakes? about is if we start doing burnouts on this thing, manual brakes are going to be hard to hold while you're doing the burnouts. Uh, that, that, that could be. Guys, let us know in the comments down below. We'll see you tomorrow. All right, guys. Well, I couldn't find that wing nut, so we're going to have to order. I'm just going to go ahead and order. King nut. King nut. Wing nut. What am I thinking? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that king nut. Uh, so I'm going to order. I'm just going to go ahead and order two for the other side because you never know. If we get into that mess and it break it also. So, guys, well, we done it. You know how most people, they'll do one side and then Now, do get, one side first down. and then do the other and side. And then do the other side and film it so it looks easy. No, we're going to give you the hardest, the roughest. We're going to do the first side, and you're going to see it. Yep. <laughs> that's just the way we are. That's so, how we always do it. Yeah, that's how we do it. We just make it. We just do it, and however it goes, it goes. Whatever happens, happens. Yeah, because we we want to be real with you. Yeah. So, guys, we'll, we'll order that. We'll get that. We'll do the other side off camera. Yeah. But, guys, thanks for watching, and we'll see you later. Peace.